target over on the side here. Um, I just have had another small success mucking around with gear, um, trying to see if we can uh, basically control everything <laughs> from a um, from a trumpet mic. Um, so I think in a previous video I've uh, shown the um, iRig. Uh, sorry, the um, I'm trying to hold it up, but it won't get in front of the camera. That's a shame. The uh, MIDI guitar app um, for iPhone. Uh, it's quite a fast audio to MIDI um, conversion engine. Um, and what I've gone out and got today, which I am quite happy with, uh, even though it's another 120 bucks worth of gear, is uh, the iRig uh, MIDI adapter and um, the um, iRig uh, sort of microphone adapter for iPhone. So now what I'm trying to do here, and it roughly works, is play through, whoops, I just heard a bit of it from the interference, um, the um, Yamaha Silent Brass mic uh, that's coming into the MIDI guitar app and then iRig is then feeding into Reason. Uh, the really cool thing is that in Reason 7 uh, there's going to be MIDI out. Uh, I've been testing the beta and it works really well. <laughs> I was amazed at how well the MIDI out works. Um, so we will be able to kind of do this in a reverse way, um, sending um, sort of uh, you know audio signals to Neptune for example and getting that translated to um, CV and that can go then back to the iPhone I haven't quite made that smooth yet but it does work uh, and it's pretty exciting to be able to do that uh, but the latency with Neptune is unfortunately a little bit worse than the latency with uh, the MIDI guitar app here so anyway um, so what you'll see here in the rack is that I've uh, hooked up just the um, the auto arp uh, um, instrument, which uh, is quite a helpful little sequencer, and uh, and then it's just running a mouse track. So I promise you, I'm not touching any keyboards. And then a really cool thing: if you just turn on the sequencer, you can get. So I think that that's pretty workable. Um, and of course here, you, you know, you can change it to anything you want. Um, you know, because the reason is so massive in its, you know, sort of twistability and whatnot, you know, you go and just drop in a, you know, some sort of poly here. <laughs> can you can control whatever the heck you want you turn this off and you go to a mono synth and whatnot and uh, you know it is really it's quite usable um, I've been wanting to try this out and see what I can do yeah, yeah what's it here's a mono synth what's this sound like <coughs> You know, it kind of worked out. I should probably fix the latency and whatnot, but yeah, there you go. So, Yamaha uh, Silent Brass into MIDI guitar app through iRig MIDI adapter back into Reason. Good fun. <laughs>